picking when? You, you've been picking and you haven't. Your your fingers aren't moving like they used to. Right. I know where I want my fingers to go, but they will not go there. <laughs> that sounds my life story. That's my life story right there, Don. Well, we did. I'm so glad that we've got the young guys coming along playing because I was afraid that our bluegrass top music was gone. I mean, I'm not doing any bluegrass top. I can't. I can't do it. Uh, but that's what I really know. So you used to go down to Old Hog Bottom, right? Yeah. What was the other place you said you used to go down to? And oh, it, Henderson, Alabama. Henderson, Alabama. Yeah. That, but down there on the river on the Chattahoochee. No. What was it? That was, uh, now that's, uh, down there on the Chattahoochee, uh, that's, uh, down at New Falla. New Falla, that's what it was, yeah, New Falla. Yeah, we've had that, that's every spring, we have that, uh, that's just a bunch of guys getting together camping, you know, we don't put on a show, it's just more or less the parking lot, like we did at, uh, What's Pick as you please. Terry Cassidy's right. picking party. Yeah. Uh, Henderson, you actually have shows. Uh, you can make up a group of guys out in the parking lot, and you can get together so you get up on the stage and perform. Yeah, so if you're clicking, you just you just say, we're ready, man. We're hot. Uh -huh. We're hot to try. We need, we need a banjo player. Hey, you want to play banjo? There you're with it. You know, come on. All here. right, there we you go. A player, you know, play bass with us. And you might play bass. Bass players always in demand. You know that. So, and, and it's better if they're females because they're better looking. <laughs> uh, female bass players are around a lot because they can they can do that and stand up there. Uh, but they usually just go, you know, just. Mm -hmm. A good bass player, he will walk all around on that bass and keeps everybody, keeps everybody in tempo, keeps everybody together. So a good bass player is there, and uh, especially on the stand-up basses and playing good bass, uh, you need something to to keep, you know, keep you in the right rhythm and going. Mm -hmm. So anyway. Yeah, if you're a bass player, I guarantee you, somebody's going to want you to get up there on stage with them and play. So, and ain't everybody, they can have them, you know, uh, those big old basses, you know, it's a, and it's not a full size bass even, that, you know, it's a three quarter bass. That's what, that's what's popular. And uh, very seldom, in our bluegrass music, do you see any electric basses? Every now and then, and some people, you know, they're easy to carry electric basses on. And then they, you were coming out with these acoustic basses, like you see my friend playing. Yeah, it was an upright acoustic. Right. Yeah. It was an upright acoustic. It yeah. looks like a guitar. Yeah, with, it, with a post on the bottom of it. Mm -hmm. And that day, there you go. But anyway. What else do you feel like singing for us, Don? Huh? What else do you feel like singing for your audience? I don't know. You got the whole world is your oyster right now. You said you like oysters, right? Yeah. I like fried oysters. You like fried oyster sandwich? I like fried oysters. Oh, white bread with some ketchup and old fried oyster. Oh, it goes down good. Okay, I'm going to start. I'm